Rosa Parks in first grade and we are making shoes for lots of different environments. So some of the kids are making shoes for the Arctic, the African savanna, the desert, the ocean, and the rainforest. Katie, I guess you have to cut it like this. Debra, good plan. What made you choose cotton balls? Because we need cotton balls for the inside to make, like, if they're walking for a long time, their feet will get, like, tired and sweaty and have all those blisters on their foot, so we needed to, like, make them feel comfortable. So we, you guys were engineers yesterday, and you made shoes that were adaptive to a few different environments. And I'm going to see what it feels like when I walk. When I walk, what's that called? Lobo Okay, so I'm going to stand up, and I'm going to see how does it feel when I'm walking. Ooh, it's so cushy. Yes, Immediately it when I saw this shoe, I thought to myself, are you okay? I thought to myself, oh, this shoe looks like an animal that we studied in the African savanna. If you know what animal this shoe looks like, raise your hand. Deborah, what animal does this shoe look like? A giraffe. It's kind of tall like a giraffe, and look at the colors. And it's got the elephant things, oh, the elephant things for shield. Can you Order. you mean uh, the, the, the yeah. cushions that elephants have on the bottom yeah. of their feet? <coughs> oh my goodness, Bestie, did you even pick up on that? This shoe has adaptations just like giraffes and just like elephants in the African savanna. They added a smiley face. So you look down at your foot and you see the smiley face, and what do you think? You think, I won't die. I'm gonna be brave and I won't be scared. I'm gonna be brave and I won't be scared. <laughs>